Good morning, friends and fellow farmers. All right, let's see. What do we have today? It is uh, going to be clear and sunny all day tomorrow, and the fortune teller says spirits are very happy today. I don't know that it's going to matter much, but it's raining, and that's all that matters. And uh, we got some mail. Hello, Mod Hodge. My name is Susan. Lewis told me you're a new farmer in town. I'm trapped in my farm on the mountains. I'm trapped on my farm in the mountains, so I can't say hi in person. Hopefully, the mess Jojo made will be cleared out soon because I'm going to uh, going a little stir crazy. Can't wait to meet you and see how the farm is shaping up. Susan. That's cool. Huh. To our valued George Mark customers, our team members have removed the landslide caused by our drilling operation near the mountain lake. I'd like to remind you that our drilling operation is entirely legal pursuant to Initiative L61091 Joja Co. Amendment. Responsible stewardship of the local environment is our top priority. We apologize for any inconvenience this may have caused. As always, we value your continued support and patronage. Morris. Yeah, let's get our parsnips. Uh, let's harvest these. And uh, I have no interest in uh, hanging out with Morris. I don't think we're going to be join joining the Joji gang. So we got 15 parsnips there. I don't have any more mixed seeds. We're going to have to go and buy some stuff. Um, okay, we got 100 cheap for that. Well, thank goodness. <laughs> Raising animals. Okay, build a coop. Reach farming level 1 and craft a scarecrow. Oh, is that a thing I can... No, I got to first get farming level 1. Okay, where are we at with that? Uh, I, I thought we had farming level one. Hmm. Nah, well, we'll see. Now, we should be able to just go and sell our parsnips right away, right? And get some extra seed money, I think. Uh, let's see what we can do here. And, uh, I guess I'll check. Yeah, okay, he's back on the copper request. Oh, it's locked, right? They're not open yet. <laughs> Well, I guess that's an opportunity for me to rummage through the garbage. Let's take a look also. Uh, I haven't done a proper glance here at, at all of our friends. So Victor, uh, Andy, we've met Olivia. Oh, Olivia is single. I see she's one of the dating options. Uh, who else here? Sophia. Uh, Martin. I, oh, I, that works at the George Mart, right? Oh, we haven't met... Wow, okay, yeah, we've got some obvious people we have to still meet here. Oh my goodness. Okay, and it just, uh, there's more. There's more. So, let's go, this, uh, no one's home or available yet. <laughs> 8 a.m. And I didn't bring my, oh, I didn't bring my, uh, my fishing rod. Okay, let's check their garbage. What you got? Nothing. People gotta keep better stuff in their garbage, I tell ya. Now let's go check around back over here. Is there anything cool going on? Whoa, what's that over there? Okay, that's kind of cool. Um, little bridge there. Okay, and that kind of stops there. Nothing happening here. Okay, no. Doesn't seem like we can go into anything there. Um, hmm. Okay. I don't know how we get over to that if we do. Oh, on the other side, are we able to? Maybe we can. I'm intrigued. Oh, I think we can. Oh, that's really cool. I didn't even notice that this whole area opens up. Wow. And there's uh, the Pelican. Pelican Town, date 041719XX. Built in recognition of Sturdy Valley's elegance. That's very nice. Look at us. Elegance, elegance, yeah. Make sure it actually said elegance. And then uh, we don't really know what else is going on around here. Could be more, but it seems like that might be it. That just is a good use of that area. Huh, that's cool. Okay, and then uh, can we break into the Joja van? Take things. There's a box back there. All right. Oh, hey, it's Shane. Don't you have work to do? <laughs> Oh, dude, you're killing me. Claire, ah, hi, I haven't seen you before. Sorry, I don't really know you all that well. Claire edges away from you. Oh, it's okay, Claire. Go ahead, let me get out of the way here. Uh, okay, I got, yeah, we, we got stuff to do. Claire seems a little bit, um, worried. So we'll have to, uh, see. I'm imagining she has a lot, a, bit, a bunch of story going on. George, huh. it's irritating to have to meet all these new people, huh? Name's George, by the way, now buzz off. All right, um, that's cool. Hey, Alex. 
Hey, what's up, farmer guy? Evelyn. George spends a whole day in front of that darn television set. I wish he'd go outside more. Fresh air would do him some good. Uh, let's go see Pierre. Let's go see if we can dump off our, uh, our seeds here. Uh, okay, let's go below. Do, 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 do. Here we go, bud. Um, yeah, we'll sell this for 525. And then I'll buy... So, there we go. I could buy a whole pile more. Uh, I think I'm going to go with... Buy some cauliflower. Uh, buy uh, jazz and... Uh, another potato. We can plant it in a minute. That's good. It's it, We've got a lot of energy and we have a few more things now, which is kind of nice. So I want to go back up here and explore a little bit more. And this Is it still locked? It's locked. It doesn't have hours or anything. It's just decrepit. Can I climb in a window? Can we get, uh, get crazy? Uh, no, nothing there. Hmm. So yeah, that mountain path open. That should be interesting here. We'll see. I, I'm not sure yet how up, well, how long I'll do the episodes. Um, usually I do one episode uh, for all the other Stardew, for anybody who's watched those ones. I do about one day an episode. But we'll see with this in the sense that um, early on, I don't know that the, the days seem to go a little bit faster. So we might uh, we might be able to do a couple days in. We'll see. Please don't destroy my tent. Oh, gosh, buddy. I'm so sorry. Just want to leave him alone. Poor guy. Please don't destroy my tent. What kind of people is he dealing with? Alright, there we go. Oh, interesting. Ho ho, wow. Uh oh, I, my inventory is full. Oh goodness, what is this now? Oh wow, what? Oh, if we get some wares, Sword of Yoba, Edge of Time, Honjo Mas Masumune, Blade of a Thousand Cuts, Stalker, Oath Keeper. <laughs> Those are great. Uh, what do we have going on back here? It's an old dusty ledger. Doesn't seem like it's been used for a while. They got bunks. A venture gear is crafted on this table. Minerals and gems collected from the expeditions from the mines. What do you got in the bookshelf? Monster Almanac Volume 6. Tales of the Crimson Sands by Draco M. Hey, buddy. Okay, and uh, can I come? Hmm? All right, well, we've met you. Okay, there's our monster eradication goals. Hey, Gil. Come back and see me when you guys have to show me their kid. All right, Gil. Whoa, it is definitely misty out. Oh, what is this? Oh, my goodness. I love it. What... In loving memory of Isabel, beloved wife, mentor, and adventurer, may you rest in peace, my flower. I don't know what that is. Is that Marlon's wife, or is this is that a bit of story, or what is that? You shouldn't use Marlon's bow without, without permission. Oh my goodness, what? That is cool. Huh. Wow. Alright, um... Let's just go and take a peek, I guess. Oh no, we don't, dude, I don't have inventory space. Huh? I was just wondering how far the down this mine shaft goes. I'm gonna take care of some of the monsters in here before they start climbing out into the valley. I've met a lot of adventurers in my time. I recognize that look in your eye, in your gaze. Old age hasn't robbed me of my eyesight or my skill with a sword quite yet. Take this weapon. It may not look like much, but it's imbued with magic. With it, you'll be able to battle the monsters here. Thank you, Marlin. Sweet. You received a rusty sword. Oh, you can make me make the choice. Okay, well, I'll get rid of the CD I found. I'll keep my eye on you. Prove yourself and I might uh, think about making you a member. Nice. Okay, so we've got that and that's still out of order. Oh, we, I need to, uh, 
go home. <laughs> That's what I need to do. Now that we know where this is, I don't have any inventory space is the issue. Um, or, well, you know what I guess I could do? I could do this. Uh, no, let's just go. We're going to come back. Um, we can also take Clint's quest and get 20 ores while we're at it. That's really cool. I love it. Um, now, down here, right, is the burned out bridge. Now, what do I need for this? Oh, it's, okay, I, nothing. And then down here, what would, what would this lead to? Sometimes I feel like these are like, I should be able to like mine my way into this. No. All right. Oh, you can kind of come down here. Oh, that's neat. Wow. Well, there's a lot going on here. Um, a lot more trees. That's really cool. Like, and I should be able to take these out. That'll make a big difference. Okay, so, uh, yeah, explore the mine. Reach level 5. 26 out of 31 introductions. That's it. That's all I've made. <laughs> oh my goodness. But, uh, so many people to meet still. Oh, dude, there you are. My friend, Sebastian. Oh, you must have just moved in, right? Cool. Out of all the places you could live, you chose Pelican Town. I, you know, it's I, it's a nice place. It's voted 1,000th on the uh, list of most livable places in the local area. No, I think it uh, it would do well. Will be. I mean, it's got a fountain. It will be uh, the, one of the best places once we're done. I think. We're gonna add some pizzazz to this place. It, to be honest, at the expanded uh, town doesn't need a lot of pizzazz added. It's a really magnificent looking town. So we've got all of this extra energy now. Uh, let's get this stuff in the ground. So we've got a total of 15 seeds. Okay, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And we'll put all these things in here. Oh, that did, never mind. I uh, miscounted how many things I had. Looking at my horseradish. <laughs> okay, it's raining. I love it when it's raining. Okay, put those things away. Um, you know what? Let's put uh, our whole... Uh, no, I'll bring my axe. Yeah, and uh, 440. Oh, uh, it's really late, isn't it? There's a part of me that was like, I just want to go and cut down some trees and stuff, but I feel like I'm not going to be able to do a lot. Can I cut down this one? No. Got to figure out which trees are show trees. Yeah, okay. Is this tree here? No, we can't. That's good, thankfully. How about this one here? Nope. And this one looks like I might. Nope. You? No. That's okay. Alright, uh, this probably has something to do with the way things spawn in on this area. Hope it falls the right way. There we go. Don't want a little thing in the wrong direction there. Wow, it is like you get, oh, I think we'll be able to do like three trees and then we're going to be toast. That is unbelievable. Okay. Yeah, that's a decent haul of stuff. Now I'd like to cut down a couple of other tree types because then we can make more of our seeds. But this mountain area only really seems to have pine. Which, that's not going to help me. Let's go on that little trail to the left and we'll see what's happened over here. Felt like there was a few. Of, no, it is just, oh my gosh. There's a lot of trees though. So, I mean, that is, that's something. That's kind of cool. Yeah, and these are all trimmable. go and what do I feel like that that seems like something going on there 
Is that just markings on the... Oh, no, it's just a plant growing on the, the hillside. Never mind. Some, uh... Some little plant hanging on, clinging for its life. Alright, nothing else going on there. Yeah, I want to get doing the, uh, doing stuff, but it, we are shockingly weak. <laughs> That's another thing I'm thinking about, is like how brutally weak we are. I will get knocked out if I do anything. If I pickaxe more than 20 things, I'd be, uh, unconscious. Alright, um, now if I could find some more pine cone seeds or whatever, uh, we'd be able to maybe craft up a few more things here. Okay, let's, uh, oh no, I gotta go dump off stuff at home. Okay, let's do that, and then... Yeah, you know what? Let's just get some sleep. I was thinking I would want to... I haven't even tried fishing yet. Um, I was thinking I would want to make up a, a, uh, a thing, but I can only make one. I need to get, uh... Got lots of pine cones now. I just need some other seeds. Yeah, sometimes, like, just giving things a shake. <laughs> that tree's not going to give me anything ever. That's 9.30. We can hit the brakes here. I think we'll keep going a little bit. We'll play another uh, another day. Yeah, these early days, they go so fast because we're not staying up till 1 in the morning. There we go. We got a scarecrow. We learned basic fertilizer. Fantastic. Okay, well, let's take a look at what today's all about. Uh... Weather, beautiful sunny day tomorrow, and fortune teller says, Spirits are very displeased today. Well, today's not a good day to go mining anyway, then. Now, um, let's put away our wood. Let's get this, and let's get the fiber, and let's see. Okay, I'm going to make a bunch of fertilizer. Now, if I'm, I, I, I don't know if I can... Yeah, I can put in the new seeds. Okay, that's good. Well, you, yeah, okay, that's, that's fine. I was able to use up a bunch of it. Yeah, okay, good enough. Interesting, I wasn't able to use it. must be added before planting. The other stuff took it, but the the other new ones, no. Uh, weird. Okay, and then the scarecrow, I need... What do I need? Wood, coal, fiber. Uh, what do I got? 290 wood. Oh, uh... I guess we got rid of that one sap there. And we'll put uh, you right in the middle. There we are. Let's get watering. Uh, let's go grab some water, I guess. So, so far so good. Um, yeah, I, again, I still feel like I'm. there's so much map that I'm barely scratching the surface on. Uh, going mining is going to definitely be a hard thing to do initially until we get uh, those mine carts opened up. <laughs> That's going to be a big deal, I feel like, because we're going to be struggling with um, just the time. Uh, getting back before we black out is going to be a little bit harder. Oh, for Pete's sakes. Um, so that's going to be a challenge, I think, that we're going to have to work on. Other than that... I don't know. Yeah, I think it's going to be good. I, I love the scenery, though. I love the expansion of the whole environment. It really feels like a much more significant, significant kind of thing. Uh, I'm intrigued about the boat. That's really cool. There's a lot of that, I find, uh, so far. I'm, I'm very intrigued by a lot of what might get opened up for us that we have no idea about yet. That's really the coolest part. What awaits us? Uh, I'm gonna check out how many more people I got to go and meet. Um, oh, we got 100 bucks. That's nice. Okay, uh, and we 27 out of 31 people. Um, who am I still sort of missing? So we haven't met. Oh, J uh, Clint, Abigail, Harvey. Oh, we haven't met Marnie or the wizard. 
Okay, we can do those relatively easily. So now let's be a little bit smarter today and leave home some of our stuff. Um, what am I going to go and work on? I don't know, <laughs> to be honest. Um, I'll bring the field snack with me. We might get in, into some stuff here. Uh, I got some fiber I picked up from before. Let's in fact dump that off right away. Uh, and you know what? I will bring the other seeds with me. Because we can make already another field snack. So let's, let's try to make it a field snack day. Maybe do some foraging. Go do a little bit of looking around. Uh, I am still not sure why we'd want that shortcut there. <laughs> I have no idea what the logic of the, there's a reason and I'm not sure what the reason is yet. I'm sure there's something cool. Now I can't. Yeah. <laughs> I can try and take them. Hello, Marnie. Ah, Mayor Luce told me you just arrived. I'm Marnie. I sell livestock and animal care products at my ranch. You should swing by sometime. I, I have swung by. It's sometime. I like the decoration here. Why are you bothering me? I want to be alone. All right. I can accommodate that request. Uh, I'm not going to go bug a child in their room. Oh, you know what I want to see is, oh, does she have any interesting one message? I want to hear what that message says. It's the mayor. You smell like grass. Hmm. Oh, like that's, uh, I guess, better to smell like grass than smell like something worse. Uh, what's in here? Oh, what? Hello. Some kind of machine used for processing wood. Manifest. Expenses, income, profit, 47,000. Animals, 14 cows. Shipment. Uh, 25. Wow, okay. I don't know what, why we want to know about that. That's really cool. Chest is unlocked. You open the chest to see what's inside. To satisfy your curiosity, you'll only find another chest that's locked. <laughs> Cheese presses are hard at work. Okay. So she's got uh, all kinds of stuff going on. And there's a Marnie's workbench. Various stuff. And then what's on? No, it doesn't tell us about the uh, the novel she's working on. Marnie's seat maker. Does Marnie cut wood or Shane? Big questions. Big questions waiting to be asked. All right, let's go and see the wizard. Although, are we even able to go and see him yet? I feel like we're going to be like somebody's home, but we don't know. Um... I feel like we should be able to get some seeds from Shaking Trees, but I don't know about down here. Uh, uh, you know, I really love that they've added all of this stuff down here. If the local fishing scene ever got a bit more lively, I might oh, I might expand the, sh the, the, sh the shop stock. I'm not talking in uh, ocean, Oceanese. Oh, wow. That's nice. What is this now? Pelicatown Fairhaven Farm Blue Moon Vineyard. Ah, I see. This is like the beach shortcut area here. Right. Okay, and here's Sophia. Sophia. Hello. Um, hello. Okay. Cool. <laughs> Glad we had this chat. Things are, uh, things are looking good. Ah, and then it just leads down into this. Ooh, this green slime smells bad. Okay, and there's spring, some spring, uh, stuff here. It's the what the detritus of uh, Shane's visitations down here. Stardrop Saloon logos on the bottles. Um, so we got ourselves some some spring onions. That's kind of nice. Fairhaven Farm. So who be here? Oh, it's Buddy. Andy sees you but chooses not to say anything. All right. The garbage can reeks. Andy's living a little rough here. Andy is living a little rough. Um, what do we got here? The, uh, definitely I had a, uh, oh, Fairhaven Farm report. Uh, expenses, net losses. Uh, he's not doing so good. I see. Uh, the radio doesn't have a battery in it. Why Georgia farming is better than organic methods. Huh, he's gone full in, huh? I'm a little concerned. Um, all right, I'm going to leave him be. We had a, uh, a family friend out in the prairies that 
um, his wife had passed on and he raised his boys on his own. And, uh, oh wow, there's even more down here. Remains of a campfire. Um, yeah, it was really cool. Wow, this goes all the way over here. It was really cool, um, you know, hanging out on their farm when I was a kid. But it was also, there was a lot of like, this is how bachelors live. It was pretty good. It was pretty clean and stuff. It wasn't quite as bad as Andy's place there, but definitely it was, it was pretty rough. And you're like, this is what happens when bachelors are, uh, you know, he's, he's a busy farmer. He doesn't have time to be worried about other stuff. He's busy raising kids on his own. And that uh, pretty tough. That's a, a tough road to hoe. Oh my gosh, what? <laughs> this is madness. Oh, I feel like I'm gonna die. There's a, uh, as in like, I'm not gonna make it home on time. <laughs> wow, okay. Uh, oh, there's a hole. Is there, is this, can I get in there somehow? Uh, I feel like somehow there's something in there. That's really cool, whatever it is. Oh, there's groves and stuff down in here. Oh, interesting, okay. Oh wow, okay, so, uh, I don't have the ability to pull, grab any of that stuff. Oh my goodness, what? Okay, uh, I don't know. That, uh, this is a massive bit of map though. <laughs> So I don't know what's in my way, if it's like a, a stump. Um, I'm not hitting anything that I am like, I can't get past, so I don't know. I just wanted to come and see the wizard. Oh, maybe I gotta come at it from the bottom, in which case this is like out of control. Wow, there is so much forest here, oh my goodness. What? <laughs> this is utter madness. Oh, is that a, that's a wicked cool sword? Is that what that is? Okay, horse radish. Uh, actually, I've got to get rid of that dandelion. We found an ancient sword. What? You found an artifact that curated a local me. Oh, that's really cool. Okay. There's more? Oh my gosh. What? I, I can't take them all. Oh no, they'll stack. And then this one here, is that one I can, I don't know if I can take it. Uh, uh, <laughs> let's see, I'm gonna eat the spring onion here. This one, the silver one. I can take the forest sword. Now the forest sword has a way better, that's an artifact, but this thing, eight to 18 damage plus two plus one. Oh yeah. That's a much better deal right there. That's 5.20 p.m. I gotta pay attention. Oh my goodness. Well, that was really unexpected. I, I thought there might be some really cool areas in this map, but I had no idea they'd be this big. I'm kind of scared. <laughs> uh, what? There's, yeah, there's, there's secrets here for sure. Okay. It's 5.50. Uh, yeah, I just wanted to go see the wizard. But there's like 200 trees to cut down. I don't know where I want to go. Oh my goodness. Well, this is a fantastic use of the space. Um, like, definitely feel, oh, there's, yeah, there's some leak growing in there. So it can definitely come find stuff down here as well. That's really cool. Use our new blade. Slice through some grass. So I don't know if this fodder will uh, add to my collection or not. What is this about? Where am I? <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, okay, the tree is in my way. Is that what's going on? What? There's maple syrup beer. Oh my gosh. Okay, there's a bear that lives here. I gotta go. <laughs> this is crazy. <sighs> Okay, I can't even cut that tree down. Oh boy. So I'm kind of like 
stuck. Uh, how did I get down? There, right? Oh my gosh, okay. There, is that it? Good. I feel like uh, it's just not, it's gonna end badly here if I don't hurry up and get home. I don't want to pass out out here. This is a long ways from home. Oh boy. <laughs> And I also have no idea where I am. I, will the map uh, show me anything? Let's see here. Mm, I don't see X marks a spot here, no. Oh yeah, so we're in the massive woodlands. I love it. It's This is really, really cool. Okay, uh, what does it say? Riv... R R R uh, what? Av... R Av... I can't read it because it's dark. Uh, Aurora Vineyard, the Dawkins residence. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Oh, it looks like the uh, the community center. Oh, there's another. Oh gosh, there's so much stuff here. Okay, uh, there's a doll. There's. That is really cool. This, that is great little environmental uses of uh, all of the things we know about because you, you definitely get a sense of like... Um, that that that's backstory. All those things are, that are kind of mundane in the normal story, we're getting the the, the fleshed out story for them now. Okay. Oh. <laughs> I'm really blown away by the size of this, and I'm so excited to go and do more exploring in this. Uh, does that bring us back finally? <laughs> that's fantastic. Wow. I, that, yeah, no, I love it. So, like, multiple secret locations, a little bit of storytelling happening there. I'm so excited to go and check out that other place. Oh, it's locked. Yeah, we can hear someone. Yeah, I think that's the case until we really open up the thing and then we go and find out about the, um, the, uh, what do you call them? Uh, <laughs> the little dudes. Oh my gosh. My brain just took in too much information. That is, uh, that is so cool. Um, all right, yeah, there we go. Then up we go. Well, I, I was a little concerned genuinely that I wasn't going to make it back in time. Because, I mean, we got some stuff, but yikes. Okay, what do I want to do here? Um, okay, well, I'm glad you haven't seen any crows today. That's good. So get rid of all of that, and I think we can bring those to Gunter. Um, now, these spring onions, I... Let's sell one of them, just to do. Let's sell one of those as well, sell one of those. Uh, just try to get on the sell one of everything train here, actually. One of those, one of those, one of those, one of those. I don't recall if it, uh, yeah, no, it does matter, doesn't it? Uh, will you? And we'll see our, uh, yeah, our list of things. That's open that up a little bit and start remembering how much things go for. Well, that was a big day. Oh my gosh. So we got this nice new sword. I'm very excited about that. That is going to make a huge difference uh, right out of the gate, I think. Um, that'll save our skin a little bit. Definitely still need to get doing a bit of um, a bit of fishing. We got a, I, I, that whole air, oh, forest area blew my mind. That is so much area. If that's all cut downable for us and it respawns, I mean, your wood is taken care of. So that kind of solves that problem of why we always have to make extra forests everywhere. Now we have it. We have a massive forest. I'm assuming it respawns. Um, we'll have to go and try it out. I would imagine it does. That is really neat. And yeah, more to explore. I feel like I just kind of scratched the surface on that. There's going to be more. Um, I definitely want to also have, a, I think, a speed buff before I spend a lot of time there. Although that house we can go find easy enough off that left trail. Oh, I'm, I'm super jazzed. We'll get to it next time. We'll see you all then. Bye-bye.